were most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known. Anyone who pled at your perfection, implored thy help, or sought intercession, was left naked, and spared with his countenance. I fly to thee, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, that in thy clemency hear and answer.
land and revived the fortunes of Jacob. You forgave the guilt of your people and covered all their sins. You averted all your age. You calmed the heat of your anger. Revive us now, God, our helper. Put an end to your grievance against us. Will you be angry with us forever? Will your anger never cease? Will you not restore again our life, that your people may rejoice in you? Let us hear, O Lord, your mercy, and give us your saving help. I will hear what the Lord God has to say, a voice that speaks of peace. Peace for his people and his friends, and those who turn to him in their hearts. His help is near for those who hear him, and his glory will dwell in our land. Mercy and faithfulness have met, Justice and peace have embraced. Faithfulness shall spring from the earth, and justice look down from heaven. The Lord will make us prosper, and our earth shall yield its fruit. Justice shall march before him, and peace shall follow his steps. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. The Spirit is the witness, because the Spirit is the truth. <coughs> Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God, have mercy on me, Lord. For I cry to you all the day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving, full of love to all who call. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will Surely you will reply. Among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, nor work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you and glorify your name, O Lord. For you are great and do marvelous deeds, you who alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud have risen against me. Ruthless men seek my life, to you they pay no heed. But you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O give your strength to your servant, and save your handmaid son. Show me a sign of your favor, that my foes may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your help. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, 
to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. <coughs> the Spirit is the witness, because the Spirit is the truth. <coughs> Let your light shine before men, that they may give glory to your Father. In days to come, the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established as the highest mountain and raised above the hills. All nations shall stream toward it. Many people shall come and say, Come, let us climb the Lord's mountain to the house of the God of Jacob, that he may instruct us in his ways, that we may walk in his paths. For from Zion shall go forth instruction, and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. He shall judge between the nations, and impose terms on many people, they shall beat their swords into plowshares, and their spears into pruning hooks. One nation shall not raise the sword against another, nor shall they train for war again. O house of Jacob, come, let us walk in the light of the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Let your light shine before men, that they may give glory to your Father. Glory to God in the highest, who sing a new song to the Lord, sing to the Lord all the earth, who sing to the Lord, bless his name, proclaim his self day by day, <coughs> tell among the nations his glory, and his wonders among all the peoples, the Lord is great and worthy of praise. To be feared above all gods, the gods of the heathens are not. It was the Lord who made the heavens, his our majesty and state and power, and splendor in his holy place. Give the Lord, you families of peoples, give the Lord glory and power, give the Lord the glory of his name. Bring an offering and enter in his courts. Worship the Lord in his temple. O earth, tremble before him. Proclaim to the nations, God is king. The world he made firm in its place. He will judge the peoples in fairness. Let the heavens rejoice and earth be glad. Let the sea and all within it thunder praise. Let the land and all her bears rejoice. All the trees of the wood shout for joy at the presence of the Lord. For he comes, he comes to rule the earth. With justice he will rule the world. He will judge the peoples with his truth. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Glory to God in the
first letter from the first letter to the Thessalonians. You know very well that the day of the Lord is coming like a thief in the night. Just when people are saying, Peace and security, ruin will fall on them with the suddenness of pains overtaking a woman in labor, and there will be no escape. You are not in the dark, brothers, that the day should catch you off guard like a thief. No, all of you are children of light and of the day. We belong neither to darkness nor to night. Therefore, let us not be asleep like the rest, but awake and sober. trespass against us, 
and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God our Father, you filled St. Barnabas with faith and the Holy Spirit and sent him to convert the nations. Help us to proclaim the gospel by word and deed. We ask this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And, and with, with your, your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary. And she conceived by the Holy Spirit. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to thy word. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known through the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. <clears throat>